and Spritzy going out, going at it. Sorry, Spritzy. Uh, Spritzy. I don't know if you know this. Is that an adjective? I, I don't know, but he so he played in Tennessee, and he's also he said he's played in New York, and uh, he's come in. He knocked off the number one seed in the tournament uh, nationwide, and so he's looking to continue this run a little bit further if he can. As uh, he's he's just kind of had a storybook go at it right here, but so has Vibe been dominating to get himself all the way into the winner's finals, which is where we find ourselves right now. And Spritzy with the stock advantage. Wants to try and keep this going. Has vibe to 105%. And the stock down, too. I just noticed that. I don't, I don't know if I was... And that's another... Or something. Uh, no, sorry, sorry. I, I, got, I got ahead of myself. They're both a little purple. Um, but that was Ivysaur. Yeah, they're looking like Oompa Loompas out there. <laughs> And Spritzy, if he's able to grab this stock, which he Ooh. does, finds himself with a massive advantage here. Let's see, so one thing I do know about this Pokemon trainer character, this little turtle dude, he's annoying. I wish <laughs> I could throw him away like I can a Mario Kart. <laughs> the plant dude, I, I haven't taken botany yet, so I really don't know. I know they like water. And I know the turtle do. Oh, wow! The spike from Vibe to even this Let's back up. Say, all I know is that dragon, he hurts. He does. And usually you see mostly, um, you'll see Squirtle and Ivysaur a lot. But he has done a good job with the Charizard oh, today when it's been out. They got names. They do have, I'm, they are Pokemon. I'm not so. calling them. Well, they, <laughs> and Spritzy going to close it out. I won't be remembering that guy's name. It's gone. And that was a game of runs right there as it started off all spritzy, then went the way of vibe, kind of evened it back up, and then spritzy closed it out, only taking 10% of damage after it was evened up at one stock apiece. Spritzy putting the rest of the scene on notice right now that he is here to stay has been playing very very good so far, taking out a few of the top competitors in this tournament. And wants to make Vibe the next one. So he plays that Toon Link. I think we saw him play Lucas maybe early on. Um, so we've seen him. We've seen a little bit of uh, variety, Lucas. but it's been all Toon Link in these later rounds. So this guy just likes playing as the annoying kids. Uh, <laughs> I don't know, but <laughs> um, I, he's he's getting put through the ringer right now. Vibe just hit a pretty nice combo on him. With yeah, vibe is vibe is doing really good right now, and I saw in the chat actually from Master Boo, if you uh, if you come, you can take souvenirs. We will uh, Jackson will sign sign all the autographs uh, that you want. I don't know what souvenir she's wanting to take. <laughs> I've asked Coach for souvenirs, and he's told me to get out the room every time. <laughs> oh. oh, and the dragon is back at it. You know, as it's kind of a fairy tale. You know, he got a knight with a sword and shield, and he's fighting a dragon. I guess you guess there's a lady in the background. Can we say she's the princess? Is this like Shrek? That is the Pokemon trainer. Oh, it's the Pokemon <laughs> trainer. <laughs> that is the one who trains them. It's, and I is the one who knocks. <laughs> right now, Vibe doing a really good job of bouncing back here. Has Spritzy to 101%. While he still has all three of his stocks and is at 118 himself. Spritzy, though, going to take <laughs> I, that. I, I'm not sure what happened right there. But will end up getting that stock, and it's back to Ivysaur, actually. Had Squirtle out, elected to just go straight to the Ivysaur. Hasn't had good luck with Squirtle so far. I mean, who, who would? It's a turtle. <laughs> I, the only turtle I know that does a lot is Bowser. Bowser is uh, he, he's a big fellow, though. Squirtle is not. True. And they are... I mean, Spritzy trying to get himself back into this one. He's at 167%, but all of this damage is kind of extra credit uh, against Vibe right now. Is um, He is at a higher than normal percentage for a Toon Link. Yeah, yeah. And he's going to try and keep evening this up as he drops that bomb off the edge. Has him to 83. Pulling out the dragon, you know, he needs to... Oh. And that's going to take the stock uh, for that's, sure. That looked like it would hurt a lot, <laughs> so I, I'm sure he was just wanting to do that. And Spritzy wants to even this up before he takes much damage himself here. And he's going to try and do it. Has him at 126. 
that going to throw him pretty far mm -hmm. off the stage. Ivysaur would have made it back, back. and oh. neither will Charizard. It is one stock apiece. We're back to an even match. 0% for both of them. The first damage will go the way of Spritzy, who wants to go up 2-0 in this one. He has been incredible so far so he's throughout this tournament yeah, as... The closest match that he's had so far has been 3-1 in the game count. So, um, Well, you know, there's a first time for everything. He has been playing very well, but right now, Vibe's got him on the ropes. Going to try and finish it off. Starting to look like that ver first time right now. <laughs> and he's going to try and back him up. This was a pretty heavy advantage for Vibe to start this one, but Spritzy brought it back. And going to try and finish it off if he can. Has him at 85%. Vibe needs the right oh. combo to finish it. Got hit by his own bomb right there. The difference between 1-1 one, one and 2-0 is huge right here. As he pulled out the Charizard, will make it back to stage. Oh. But that's going to take the stock as Spritzy brought it back to take a 2-0 lead in this one. And that is big time oh. from the man himself, Spritzy. Again, this man been all over the country and has has PR'd, I know, in Tennessee. He said he played in New York. I'm not sure. Tennessee? Mm -hmm. No, Landon, you're the only 10 I see. <sighs> That's just the nicest thing anyone's ever said to me. Oh, you're welcome. <laughs> it, it's kind of teetering on the edge of Rule 8, but <laughs> yeah, I've, I've been known to break the rules sometimes. <laughs> and right now we're getting into the third game. Vibe has to take this. Or Spritzy Here. will be moving on again. Landon, I have you know, a little bit of insight, if you will. But do you think that um, Vibe choosing these purple colors, you think that helps him like focus? Or you think uh, it's just because it's, it's his vibe? Yeah, you don't know. Purple's the best color. That's I, all I'm going to say. I, I'm not going to address the Vibe pun. I will agree with that. Oh, what do you mean? Puns are the best. <laughs> and... Uh, Back to the game, three stocks a piece for him, but both of them right even at that 85 to 90 percent mark. And we'll see if anyone's able to break this thing open, as these have been a pretty close matches so far. The last one extremely close. Uh, Spritzy was able to get the comeback. Oh, that was a nasty parry into. Oh, not a kill. Never mind. Very close little, to it though. Oh, plant man. And oh. that's going to do it. Spritzy going to take the first stock here. He's at 98% himself, so Vibe's still in a really good spot. Needs to do a little bit more here, though, if he wants to move on. At quick, least have a chill. chance. I have to address some allegations real quick. Landon, I'm not aware that you can't be in the top lane when we play games together. I I, I don't gank anybody, so... Uh, okay, <laughs> fair enough. <laughs> see, I, I, I wanted to address those allegations up front right here. Because I, I see... <laughs> If some people are they're questioning me <laughs> i don't like to be questioned you can ask people i play with i don't gank <laughs> True. <laughs> uh but right now spritzy has his foot down it is all it's gas this. no break here we stopped to talk for about five seconds and spritzy has just gone away with this lead vibe needs to get something going if he wants to have a chance to continue here in the winner's bracket and move on to grand finals. See, Spritzy's helped him a bit. He got hit by like three of his own bombs in a row right there. <laughs> and oh, Spritzy and just, he knows the spacing so well, able to use that sword. Now, though, it's, though it's not as long as Ganon's and some of the other people's, um, he's able to space that out very, you know, very well. He's a kid. I wouldn't expect him to hold a sword bigger than like three feet. He uh, looks like he's like <laughs> a foot and a half right now. But. That's going to take another stock. He could hold Ganon's sword for sure. I, I don't know, dude. <laughs> that, thing, that thing makes me... Th like It just seems like it takes up the entire screen half the time, so... <laughs> Vibe down to his last stock here. Only 36% though, so he does have a lot of room to get this thing going in the right direction. He is playing a little safe though. He's he threw out a lot of those projectiles trying to match the tune link. And Spritzy is just all over it right now. I say I don't, as far as I know, you really don't want to get to a ranged match with a, any of the links pretty much. Yeah, and Spritzy does a good job using those bombs. Um I don't know 
don't know a whole lot about the differences between the the links, but um, does a good job using the bombs to I his advantage. Breath of the Wild Link is the only one that doesn't have time bombs because he's got the ping and it blows up. Yeah. This Ooh. is going to Again? take a stock right there. One stock a piece. Oh, he seems to really like the plant dinosaur. <laughs> <laughs> Ivysaur is the strongest. He's got really good aerials. Uh, a lot of people like him for that. See, I've I've heard the spike sound of quite a bit. Yeah, that that is that is the the scary part of Ivysaur. Oh, oh. and Spritzy going to finish off right. Vibe right there. Look. Three to zero. What a showing here today by Spritzy. As he advances to the grand finals of the tournament here in the first ever Sunday School Smash. We've got a few more games on the loser side of things. We've got Trey and Nationwide coming up. And then the winner of that game will face uh, Vibe in the losers finals, I believe. And that person will play in the grand finals.